Hello everyone, welcome back to another Astros franchise video. Today we'll be starting off the series versus the Detroit Tigers. They're 2-1, we're 3-1. So let's go ahead and see how this goes. Now I'm wearing something different, but I'm tired of wearing the same stuff. Are they still doing Space City Mondays? Because we'll just do that, why not? Wear something different. And let's go ahead, Minute Maid, Roof, play a close game, why not? Nokiti's gonna start, leave the lineup like this for now. If you don't mind, please leave a like and subscribe, it would mean a lot. And let's go ahead and get into the first game of this series. Now, let's see, Urquidy, what you got for us? So far, every pitcher besides Valdez has had like great starts to games. That's fine. Tucker is up to lead off for us. It's 1 0. One one. And out. Oh, that's cool. Steps out of the bag. One gone by half of the first. The first break will say a bray you up to hit. One of the stars of the win yesterday. As he had three hits. I just realized this lineup is different because we're facing lefties. So Maldonado is starting this game. Then we got Dubon in for... I guess he's DHing for... Um, what's his name? Brantley. Wow, could not think of his name there. I guess he's the DH. I should probably be paying attention. It's an interesting lineup. I thought that was going to go out. Chris Alvarez has turned into one of the best young hitters, maybe one of the best hitters in all of baseball. He's got some of the most raw power in the entire game. All right, so apparently, struggle versus lefties. You just got to get used to it, you know? Just got to get used to it. All right. Altuve leading off, bottom of the second. Base hit. Nice. So, we got our first hit of the game. Now McCormick is ahead of Pena in this lineup for some reason, but it is what it is. Early, way too early on that one. May see some movement over there at first base, trying to stay out of a double play here. Next pitch way upstairs. One two to McCormick. That was late. Me the super early, super late. Why can I get in between? I don't know. 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a miss struck him out. <sighs> that was late swing, wasn't it? So up next, Jerry yep, Pena. I knew it. Well, let's see what we can do with Pena. Pop it up. up. That's two outs. Next, Bergman, super far down in the lineup versus lefties. I don't know why, if he just did that. Could have probably went home, but that's fine. Got two runners in scoring position for Mauricio Dubon. Uh, 69 power, okay. 
Into the second. No runs, but we did get two hits. And that's the Urquidy. Not too bad. Maldonado leading off. He got 82 power versus the lefties. Nice. That was super late swing. Is that out? Is that gone? It is. Barely bounced off the line at the wall. Man, Maldonado might just have to be our starting catcher, which I'm fine with. I don't know why they... I mean, I guess they're going off of overall based. But honestly, I'm a big fan of Maldonado, so I'm not against him starting. I just... One, I keep forgetting to change it. And two, I just left it off of overall base just to start off. Because for some reason, they have Maldonado being like a 68 or something. Which honestly, I feel like most of the ratings in the game are pretty, like, disrespectful. Like Pena, ALCS MVP, World Series MVP, and there's only like 80 something. And then we got Tucker, he's not even that high of overall. And I think like the power stats are all wrong. But, you know, it is what it is. Strike out there. Two outs. Here's Jordan Alvarez. Hard ground ball base. Nice hit from Jordan there. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. Let's see what Altu they can do here. Right into the gap. Honestly, might be able to send Alvarez home, but I'm not going to. Man, I want to do it. Like, we had two outs, so I don't know. It might have been worth it. Guess we'll never know now. Alright, so two run single from McCormick. And all the scoring started from Maldonado. So Maldonado is the spark plug we need. And I will, I'm gonna change the lineups. He's definitely gonna be the starter. We got two on for Bregman, I believe now. Yep. That's gonna be an out. And the third, 3-0 now. All right, 3-1, nothing too bad. And Dubon leading off, bottom of the fourth. Draw, come on, draw. 
Oh man. That's fine. I mean, it's uh, my first time like ever swinging with him, so I don't know much. Come on, come on, Maldonado. Even though it's not gone, that was perfect contact, straightaway center. So I can't be mad at it being an out, but definitely gets more balls put into play, which is. I don't know why it's wrong with that, so we'll take the out. That's fine. That's my fault, Tucker. Tie game. You know what? I'm gonna just go ahead and do this. Doesn't mean anything, just for now. Hopefully we can get the lead back. Like they put a Brayu up into the two spot for versus lefties. But I mean, I haven't even gotten a single hit with them yet. Right, right to the second baseman. I just like hitting the ball right at people for an out. Let's see what Yardon can do. He's batting 500. He's 500 right now, one and two. So, he's very consistent. Perfect. Can you go? Now I'm just going to stay two. Now two, baby. A little bit too inside there. Hey, he would swing at that in real life. And if you watch any Astros game, you know that's true. Altuve will swing at literally anything. Inside, outside, up, down. But you gotta love it though, because he gets results from it a lot, so. Can't be mad at it. Full count. Three two still. Another foul ball. What pitch was that? Seventh. And that should be another RBI. You get the lead back. Good job, Altuve. Chaz now. I mean, advances is Altuve, so it's not a terrible result to that bat, but wish it was better. And right to the pitcher. That's fine. Three to four, we get the lead back. Hopefully, Rikidi can... Well... Starts off with a home run. It's only tied, so that's not too bad. And I will definitely come and go to the bullpen after this sad bat. Is that going to be enough? No, right to him. That's fine. That is fine. Dubon now. Let's try to get him his first hit of the season. Oh, 
I'm trying, man. I'm trying to get you your first hit. Doesn't happen. Sure, it will eventually happen. Maldonado's batting 400, two home runs, three RBIs. That's fine. Man, that was right down the middle. I missed it. That's my fault. Because that would have been gone. Because, I mean, we got the greatest hitter on our team, Maldonado. The greatest hitter, yeah. Still, still is pretty good. It's pretty up there. All right, Mayton, what you got for us? You can go ahead and let's get Presley ready. Why not? Might need him anyways. Come on. Well, Mayton, you're out of there. And we'll put Neris in now. Come on, Tucker. That sucks. And stepping in for the Astros, Jose Abreu. Zero for three in this game. Swings through that one. Zero and one. Come on. All right, we got a runner on for I don't know Jordan. Yep. All right. Let's see what we can do. Missed that right down the middle. That's fine. Missed it again. But I feel like I'm swinging perfectly, but apparently I'm like super late on it. down by one. Man gave up a triple, two run home run. I don't even care. I don't care. It's fine. It's fine. It's all good, man. It's all good. It happens. That's out. Can't win them all. That's one thing. You definitely, most likely, will never see somebody win 162 games. Just same thing in basketball. It's highly unlikely. And that's fine. You got to be able to accept that. You can't win every game. You would love to get hits off of those, but it's cool. Man has two pitches and two outs. There's nothing I can do about that. I mean, I'm getting stuff I can hit, but they're just getting it. Like I, I don't, there's nothing I can do about them playing defense. You know, it's not like those were bad like hits. They just happen to be playing defense, which you would expect them to. Let's see if we can make a comeback or anything here. Yes. 
Three, two. And right to second baseman. Alright. Two more outs. That's two outs. I mean, like, that's not a bad pitch to swing at. Like, I can't control that they're getting the ball and getting us out. And our best hope to do anything? Maldonado. Nah, as I say that. Terrible swing by me. Oh. Why would you? What? What the hell did they just do? To, what? Why? Why? What did he throw to the pitcher? And the pitcher is just going to stop running and then throw it back to the first baseman. Bro, you can't just run to the back from the beginning. That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Mayton gets the loss. Okay. Kind of sucks we get the loss here. But it is what it is. And let's go look at our calendar. We're a game and a half behind Angels. But that's it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Please leave a like and subscribe. It would mean a lot. And have a great day.